everybody, Mr. Sixman here, and welcome back to Marble World. This is a super awesome marble run, and today we're going to check it out to see how good it is. I mean, this thing is actually underground, and it's got a massive drop tower, enormous elevators, spinners that are super sized, huge funnels, and a whole lot more. So first of all, we're going to have a good look around it to see how it works, and then we're going to send 10,000 marbles down it to see if we can break it. Oh yeah, and it's even got a secret toilet. So we're going to find it, and then we're going to blow it up. Nice. This is going to be a good one. So let's get on with it. Link in the description below if you want to have a go with it. Wait a minute. There's a sign over here. It says if we go right over there, we sort of jump off the end of the world and fall into the shadow realm. But if we go left, there's something else. We're going to find something very, very special indeed. That. It is an unbelievable marble run. We're about to see something amazing in this video. Okay, this is going to be good. Look, we're inside the drop tower. And you can see there's loads of spinners in here. Three, two, one, go. Okay, here come the marbles. What? Oh, no. Quick slow motion, slow motion. Whoa, in slow motion. Let's check this out. This is going to be awesome. And then down. If we look down below, look at what? Look how many marbles are going through here. This is absolutely unbelievable. This is actually a glass drop tower. So you can see all of the spinners down below. And if we just go outside it, that is chaos. But now we're going to have a look at it from the outside. Three, two, one, go. Right, the barriers are down. And look at them. Pour down that tube there and out of these big spinners. Let's put some more in first of all. And you can watch them dropping down there. Isn't that awesome? The colors look really vibrant as well. And they're going to go one of these big spinners here. We'll put one more round in. There they go, dropping down through the spinners in the tube out onto the spinning surface below. Now down here, you can see that there's some walls here, but eventually they get to a gap in the wall and that's how they drop down to different levels and they keep spinning around in different directions. It's so crazy down here. And look at this. Now they're going through the cubes here. They're even actually coming out underneath as well. I don't know what's happening down there. We'll have a look later. But over here, look, we've got a big section here with cubes. I'm just going to put one more round of marbles in in the background. And now we've got 2,880 coming through here now. Out the end, they're splitting off right and left. Let's go down this side. Um, I'm assuming they go to the same side, actually. And down here, look around the corner. Ah, oh, now we saw this a minute ago, didn't we? Look how many marbles are coming through here, down through the slats, not a really fast spinners down here, guys. Look at what that's scary. Look how fast it's going. They actually go all of the way around this really big circle here. Oh my goodness, these things are moving quick. And in the background, you can see a massive elevator. We're going to go on that in a minute. I'm just going to put a few more marbles in so we don't run out. Look at that as they pour down onto the center. There's so many marbles dropping down through the slats. Let's see where they're going when they get through here because look at this at the end a giant elevator and it's going all of the way up there let's zoom up into the sky then and see how far these things are going up that's a huge elevator look how big it is loads of marbles still coming down in the background as well but over here look absolute chaos i mean look what's going on here we've got marbles everywhere on this thing they're dropping right and left on this really big slope sort of disc here on its side let's go around the corner though and follow them down on this side. So they're dropping down here. And eventually, I think they're going to make their way back. Yes, look, into the middle again. They're all going to join up here, both sides. And then they're going to split up again just below. Let's follow them down the right-hand side now. But I think, again, they're both going to meet up. Yes, just there, underneath the track above. Look, they're all going to meet up here in the middle. And look how many marbles in the background just over there. Okay, one thing at a time before I get too excited. Okay, here's a big spinner. It's a big spinning arm, and it's gathering up the marbles marbles look and it's throwing them onto the next track just down here check this out oh that's so cool i love this a big spinner over here as well those marbles are getting held up there and then coming out in a really nice neat pile and dropping down to the next part of the track there's a big funnel there i can't wait that's a massive funnel over there now let's follow these ones around then down this really big guys that's a bridge look how cool that is it's really detailed that bridge there here they come down this really big slope here and into the giant funnel right in front of us now and look, if we just zoom out here a bit, look how many marbles are pouring into it. It's so 
awesome. I could watch this literally for hours on end without getting bored. But if we go slightly closer to the center, you can see them swirling around and eventually making their way down into the middle. So let's follow them and see where they go. Okay, so through here, coming through the bottom of that funnel, this is where they're going. Down here onto the next part of this marble run. Now there's some spikes. Oh, there's spikes here. They're probably quite sharp, actually. I better stay back from those. And check out the patterns you can see as these marbles make their way through the spikes here. And they're all making these sort of diamond shapes. It's quite amazing, isn't it? And they're trying to navigate through to the end. And hopefully none of them are going to get stuck. But I don't think they're getting stuck. It looks like they're getting all of the way to the end just over there. There's another elevator right in front of us. But they're going to go around here first. Oh. Oh, and there's, oh, there's a traffic jam, guys. We had a big traffic jam. Oh, it's getting bigger as well. We can make another traffic jam. We do this in every video, don't we? But that's good. We love traffic jams on this channel. But let's keep going down then. So all the way through those spikes. Loads more dropping down through the funnel in the background. And they're going to make their way behind this glass wall here, which is really cool. Here's another view just behind that glass wall. They're coming around the corner, bashing into the wall at the end and making that big traffic jam down here, trying to get onto that elevator, which is really big. A bit like the other one, actually. It's really big, but it's more steep, guys. I think this one is actually going steeper. And this is the very top of it now. It's a bit like a big fortress or castle, this bit now, isn't it? Because they're going all the way up here. Look, look how many marbles are coming down still in the background. The, the traffic jam's huge. The elevator's huge. And now they come off the top of it, down this slope, and then hitting the, uh, the wall at the end, bashing into it round the corner. And they're going to make their way down a bit, descending onto the lower parts of this section of the marble run. Underneath a tunnel, guys. Sort of a bridge over the top, a tunnel underneath. And they're going through there. Let's go through the tunnel and see what happens next. Okay, so down here, look. Another big slope for them to roll down. Let's go down to the end. Some spinners, which are going... Oh, that's interesting, isn't it? They're both going clockwise here. Those marbles not being phased too much by the spinners over there. But down here, look, there's two more spinners and some sort of wedges for these marbles to crash into as they're guided through this smaller gap into the spinner. And look at that, it's bashing some of them back into the sides and all sorts. But uh, they're all getting through. I don't think they're getting stuck, which is the important thing. So we've got two more spinners here. Another funnel at the end. Now that's really interesting. It's like a half funnel, isn't it? It's only half of one there. <gasps> Look at that. It's a massive funnel down there, guys. That's huge, that one. Let's go down here, though. Here's the half funnel. Let's drop down through the hole and see if we can follow them here without getting smashed into by the other marbles. There's another spinner on the wall, which is quite interesting. Look at that, just knocking some of those marbles back, holding them up a bit. And over here, a really interesting spinner or paddle sort of <laughs> set up going on with uh, different sort of alternating gaps, which is quite interesting, isn't it? So you can get through right and left, but only if you're at the right time. Let's see if we can quickly get through. Oh no, we made it. We made it without getting knocked. Anyway, down the end here, look, they're gonna drop down onto another slope and eventually end up in maybe the biggest funnel on the entire marble run. Look at the size of that thing. We're going to go through right now then and just see if we can follow. Oh no, guys, there's a big traffic jam down here. I think that's, is that the second traffic jam we've made? Uh, I think so. We've got some, oh, that's huge. This is a, it's probably not as big as the traffic jam we made in the last video because that was just massive. The last two videos, actually. But this one is actually pretty big, though. And guys, don't forget, we are going to put 10 thousand marbles on this marble run later on. There's a spinner here. Oh no, it's knocking them off. Look, they're sort of bouncing off. But I think the idea is there's the finish line, right? The checkered flag. And if you just keep going around the side here or around the corner, eventually you get to the end. Coming up, we're going to send 10,000 marbles down this marble run. And it's going to be absolutely epic. But first, we're going to go and find the secret toilet. And then we're going to smash it to pieces. Let's get on with it. There it is. It's over there. And here it is. This is the door into the secret toilet. Let's have a look through this door, shall we? And see what's on the other side. And here we go. <gasps> Whoa, it's quite big in here, actually. You didn't think I was going to come in here without some sort of marble blaster, did you? There's no chance, guys. We're definitely going to make an absolute mess of this place. <gasps> look, we've filled up the sink already. Oh, no. It's going to overflow. Oh, no. It's going to go onto the floor in a minute. Look. Oh, no. <laughs> We're making a right mess in here, aren't we? Oh, no, wait a minute. They're not dropping off the side. 
Oh yes, they are now. The janitor's going to be really unhappy with us, aren't they? They're going to have a lot of work to do when we finish with this place. That's for sure. Oh no, guys. We had a complete mess of this place already. That's what happens when you let Mr. Stixman anywhere near a sink. Total chaos. <laughs> I think we better put some more in. We're not quite done yet. That'll do. That'll do. Just for now. I think that's messy enough. Right. Look, guys, all the mess is everywhere except in the bin. <laughs> that's completely spotless in there. Everything else, though. Wait a minute. The marbles are going somewhere. Look at, the, oh, look at that. Did you see them? They're dropping down. Is there a hole in there or something? Let's go through here. I think there might be a hole, guys. Let's go down there and see where they're going. They're actually dropping through a hole, I think, because they're all disappearing down here. Right, let's keep going. Wait, hang on a minute. Oh, there it is. Yes, there's the hole. There's marbles down here. Oh! <gasps> Oh no, guys, we made another traffic jam down here in the bathroom. Oh, there they go. Look, yes, that's where th that's where we just came from. They're all dropping down in here, making even bigger traffic jams down here. If we go along here, can we go up one of the other holes? There's another one there, and there's probably another one over here. Let's go up this one and see if we can come out. There's the tap on a different sink. Let's go out through here. Oh, brilliant. There's the one where we made a mess over there, look. I wonder what's behind those doors over there. Let's go and have a look, shall we? Let's go through this one here and just see what's around the corner. We've got some marbles, and oh, there's a mug. Is that all there? Oh no, guys, only got a mug in here. I've got a plan for that. Right, don't mind me. Just moving the marble blaster. And perfect position. Lovely jubbly. We'll just put this on there like that. Perfect. Right, this is going to be a big bang. You ready? Three, two, one, go. Whoa. <laughs> yes. Guys, that was amazing. That was like a fountain of marbles. It just blasting out the mug. That was awesome. Three, two, one, go. Whoa. <laughs> yes! This is so much fun, and we're going to be in big trouble after this. We better run out of here before someone catches us. Quick, get out of here, quick. Yes, okay, right, nothing to see here. Um, <laughs> but now we're going to do something really silly, because we're going to spawn in 10,000 marbles onto this marble run to see if we can break it. Let's get on with it. Three, two, one, go. There's the first round, and you can see them rushing through the tower there. Let's put another round in as well. Now, in a minute, we are going to have to whip out a bit of slow motion here, just to make sure my computer computer doesn't evaporate into a fine mist. Get in there. Let's do another round right now and we're going to put that slow motion on at the same time. There we go. Maximum slow motion. 3,600 marbles so far. Let's put some more marbles in right now. Slow motion. There they go. They're going to drop through. Look at the chaos that happens. Let's put another round in as well. And another one. We're going to really compress them in there and watch them burst through the exit and down the tower. Through all those spinners there, guys. That is not nuts in that. It looks like a fizzy drink, doesn't it? It looks like it's sort of apple, blueberry, orange, and a uh, sort of strawberry flavor fizzy drink all in one go, doesn't it? That would taste pretty insane. Just as insane as it actually looks, to be honest. Look at the exit down here. This, oh, this is so cool. The colors look really vibrant, don't they, actually, as they come out onto this flat disc underneath. That's 5,760 marbles. So we're just over halfway at the moment. It's already chaos, isn't it? Look at this huge huge pile of them down here guys going in front of the spinning arm there that is mad there must be like a thousand marbles just behind that arm there look at there's a wave going on check this out as they come through here look smashing into the pillar and they're gonna whoa that's so awesome there's three pillars here they're crashing into some of them falling off the back is such a big pile up and here go whoa look at the wave on that one there's another one coming round and they are, whoa, that guys, that's even bigger, that one. In a minute, we are going to put more marbles in, of course, but check this out as they come through here, past the three pillars, and there we go, exiting onto the next stage of the marble run. But let's come back up to the top of the tower and put some more marbles in now. Let's put uh, three more rounds in one go. I've just spawned three rounds in one go, guys. That's over 2,000 marbles all in one go. And now we've got 7,920 marbles, and they're going to join all the other thousands thousands of them going down into the cubes and guys onto that big elevator over there let's get a few more rounds in then we've got one here to add 8600 9300 we're almost at 10,000 now this is so good i love this marble run and now we're inside the tower at the very top here are the spawners let's put the marbles in and watch them that's the last round guys 10,080 marbles Let's just uh, have a look as they filter down through these bars here. 
That is incredible. And uh, we're going to follow them down now, hopefully without getting knocked into by the spinners. We'll try and get through these gaps here. And we'll watch them go right to the bottom of the tower. And uh, we're trying to avoid get <laughs> getting hurt on these spinners. There we go. Getting through nice and easy. Go around that one. Through the slats at the bottom, or these big bars here. And out onto the marble run. Look at the size of that wave behind the... Oh, wow. Okay, that's huge. Here it comes. And there's big traffic jams going through the cubes. Here it comes. And now it's going to chuck loads of marbles into that traffic jam. Oh no, this is going to be bad. Because what if the big traffic jam here is overlapping onto the spinners? That's going to go crazy if that happens. Yeah, if we just zoom out a bit, you got... got... <laughs> I wonder how many marbles are actually on screen right now all in one go. That is nuts. Check out this view from here as well. You can see through the glass there. There's marbles coming off the cube section. And then down in the background, we've got the slats, the big spinner. My computer's going to melt and turn into lava at this point probably, but <laughs> we'll just see how it goes. Over here, just behind us as they rush underneath is the big funnel. And look how many marbles are now on this thing. Because we've got over 10,000 marbles on the run, we're going to get loads more into these funnels. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, naughty. Oh, look at that. The spikes. They're full up to the top. There's loads of marbles in the spikes. Look at the patterns you can get going through here. Oh, there's a shortcut. We missed that one earlier. Right down the end, you can see them coming out the wall there. And if we just rush down for a minute, you can see them there, look, coming out the secret passage. Right, how big is this traffic jam going to get? Because I think, what? Okay, oh, whoa, it's going around the corner. Oh, no, guys, it's going to make it back up here. Look, the traffic jam is going to be on the spike as well. Even the secret passage is going to be loading up with traffic jam as well. Hang on a minute. Because look how many marbles are still coming down here and joining the traffic jam. It's getting bigger and bigger. I mean, just to see how many marbles are going to actually end up in this traffic jam let's zoom out and see how many are still on the run look how many are in the funnel coming down here and above here look oh my goodness <gasps> they're still down there at the beginning look that this <laughs> This elevator is completely full up to the top. We've still got these ones up here. And thousands of them are still down just after the first section. Whoa, that is a huge traffic jam here, guys. Some of them are still on the uh, the spinners behind at the back. There's one coming out there as well. But uh, look how big this traffic jam is. It's enormous. Do you reckon that's bigger than the traffic jam we made in the last couple of videos? I don't think so. Actually, I think, guys, if you want to see massive traffic, traffic jams okay even bigger than this watch the uh, the last two videos we did and there's some really big traffic jams in those two videos this traffic jam is huge okay now it's in the spikes the actual jam is in the spikes you know what's going to happen don't you when this part gets clogged up with marbles there's a traffic jam which is going to go vertically up inside the funnel we'll have to see what happens with that but we could actually get a vertical traffic jam at some point that's going to be crazy this is a really cool perspective because over here look we've got the end but also we've got that middle section with the huge traffic jam and the spikes the funnel in the background and also that elevator is still full to the top with marbles and look at the size of the traffic jam in the spikes that is just a sea of marbles and spikes in front of us right now oh look at that the traffic jam down here is nearly finished yes these are the last ones and there we go i knew that was gonna happen look now we've got a <laughs> we've got a traffic jam in the secret passage oh if it gets too big though they're gonna pile up over the wall and start falling off the track over here look whoa you see that marble there it just flew off into the sky How did that happen, guys? It just... <gasps> at the back. Look over here. Remember what I said about vertical traffic jams earlier on? This is how we're going to get a vertical traffic jam. Look, now the traffic jam is inside the funnel area. So in a minute, look at that. It's half full now. When that fills up, it's going to start to pile up. And eventually, we're going to get a vertical traffic jam up into the funnel and don't worry because there are plenty more marbles to fill up this space i don't know how we've survived this far <laughs> i don't know how we've survived this far without breaking something it started the vertical traffic jam is now underway this thing's gonna get huge <laughs> No, 
Do you think we've broken it? Oh no. Oh, wait a minute. <gasps> Look in the middle. Can you see that? Here's the middle. Look at these. Guys, the marbles are going down still. It's not broken. It's still working. Let's go down here, though, and see what it's like underneath. And, uh, okay. Whoa, okay. Yeah, that's really cool. Look at this. It's just completely loaded up to the top. You can't get in anymore. There's an access point over here. But, uh, oh my, you literally, actually, no, you can't. You can't get in. <laughs> there are so many marbles here. There's almost no air gaps left. There's one here that you can see through. You can go up the side. We can sneak through here. And we'll try and sneak up the pile. Oh, there's the sky, look. We just managed to get through. That is a horizontal traffic jam into a vertical traffic jam into another horizontal traffic jam again. Brilliant. That is all we've got time for in today's video, though, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, please do hit the subscribe button, the like button, and ring the bell if you want to be notified of when my upcoming videos release. Until next time, take care, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.